Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today, let's explore the realm of demulsants. If you're eager to discover their remarkable uses and important precautions, you're in the perfect spot. These herbs have a talent for soothing, softening, and promoting healing of irritated mucous membranes. These herbs possess slippery, mucilaginous properties that create a protective coating around these membranes, safeguarding them against irritating substances and fostering a conducive environment for healing. Some well-known demulsant herbs are comfrey, marshmallow, chickweed, hollyhock, slippery elm, and aloe vera. Similar in nature, emollients are herbs used externally that share commonalities with demulsants. In fact, many demulsant herbs also double as emollients. When employed in a poultice, they effectively retain warmth and moisture while alleviating inflammation and infection. Now these herbs do have a soothing touch on the digestive tract, so they do play a critical role in safeguarding the stomach and esophagus against acid, as well as calming inflammation throughout the bowel. So conditions like heartburn, GERD, dyspepsia, indigestion, and constipation can greatly benefit from the therapeutic effects of demulsants. Now, in terms of respiratory health, these herbs work wonders by reducing dry coughs and soothing sore throats. Internally, these substances also support the urinary system, aiding in bladder inflammation, cystitis, and the presence of kidney stones or sediment. However, it is important to consult with the healthcare provider before in integrating demulsants into your regimen. The reason being, these herbs may impact the rate of drug absorption. So just as a friendly reminder, this video is created for educational purposes only. This information is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. Again, I would like to just reiterate, it is essential to speak with the healthcare provider before incorporating these herbs into your routine if you have an underlying health condition or are taking medications. But that concludes our overview today of the world of demulsants. I hope you found this video informational and enlightening. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up, share it with friends, and be sure to click the notification bell so you never miss any of my herbal content. Thank you for watching. Until next time.